Hello everyone and welcome back for another episode of Diablo 3. Uh, we have moved on to Act 5 because that's where the current bonus lies. It's only like one extra bit but it's totally worth doing. Uh, we're going to jump straight in and we're going to go and kill Adria. Have a little run through the ruins of Corvus on the way there. Wait, no we need to go all the way around the other side. Don't worry, I know where I'm going. And extra speed will help us a little bit to get through this, but not much, because we're going to be stopping to kill everything on the way. Maybe not everything, but we're going to be killing a significant number of things on the way. We want to level up. And these things are relatively easy to kill. But there's no reason to let them live. Having said, getting a whole bunch of them together at once can make it a lot more efficient. Well, just like that. 34 kills. Good experience bonus. You dare attack me! The only downside to this place is it does go on quite a way. Which can be really, really good if you're just wanting to, to level up a load, but um, if you're trying to just do the bounties and, and boss runs, then uh, I suppose we could teleport through everything. But again, I don't want to be just bypassing all the mobs, especially when I can get such a big massacre bonus. Look at this. Up to 52. 54. It's just going to be like a ton of experience. It's going to make the boss fight harder, of course, but uh, that's not necessarily going to be a bad thing. Let's back up just a little bit and we'll kill them by shooting this direction. How does that feel? All those little hexes on the floor. They're so cute. Maybe cute's the wrong word. Keeping good speed as well. Nope, not staying in that. Jailer desecrated fast. Well, it's not particularly bad, but it's just asking for trouble when you get locked in place. All right, all of that. Where are we going? We're going down this way. So we're just maybe down that way, but hopefully around this way. Hope this is the right way. If not, we can teleport our way back, but it's still not going to be particularly fast. Nineteen items, still one minute bonus. I'm just warming up. Yeah, I think this is the right way, that's good. Level 52, good progress. Eight more levels and uh, we've got this part of the uh, season journey down. I have uncovered an obscure and ancient tome in whose pages is recorded an impossible tale. The secret history of a race called the Nephilim, God by another name, and their ruined civilization in the West. If this is true, how could all signs of these Nephilim be lost? But for the record of this single... Alright, anything else? No. Round we go. We're getting there. going to loop back around again, isn't it? Yeah. That's a hell of a journey. <laughs> Talk about hiding in the, uh, the furthest reaches of the dark pit. Right, guys. We're just, you know, coming through. We'll just burn you up before. Flash during. 
Look at these little guys. Flinging green stuff at us. Okay, almost I there. I, I, can, I can feel it getting closer. There's got to be a way in at some point. Fifty-one kills. That's pretty good. Let's uh, see if we can't run on through this a little bit and get some more. Ooh, it. That's uh, a little dangerous. Still Don't mind me, we're just, you know, running I away from that so frozen good. pulse. Damn pulse. Templar seems happy enough in it, though. Nope. Oh, God. That's a bit rude. Pulling me straight back after I've teleported. And keep him alive and lead him to the next. No, not quite. 70 kills though, that's pretty damn good. That was a huge jump in experience. I should have saved a frenzy trying for the fight. In fact, let's just run in for the fight. While we've still got it. Hey, right. Burn, 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 burn. is uh, quite tough. Yeah, let's not stand on that. Fire consumes all. Now that's a cauldron eruption thing. We do have teleport to move around quickly if we need to. And where did she go? She went all the way back to do another cauldron eruption or what? Yeah, another cauldron eruption. That's fine, that just gets more blood things flying around. The power in my blood sings to me. Uh-huh. I'm sure it does. Trigger a bunch of these so that they stop getting in the way. This is this is manageable. I mean, I'd like more arcane power so I can just keep burning, but uh, you never even suspected. Yep, yeah, not standing directly on that. Near is fine. On, not so much. Two point eight million left. Split, 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 split everywhere. One million left. Down to the final, final the hurdles. The yeah, I think they can. Bang! I have done what I can Ooh, to ensure it. He always finds a way. In your heart of hearts, you know this. Alright, that was pretty epic. Okay, let's head to the Plague of Burrowers. Sounds like a new one. And what are we up to? We're up to 53.
So we'll bear in mind that uh, we will need to re-equip at some point, probably round level 55, I think. Portal to the Blighted Sewer. Ah, oh, right, so Westmarch bounties are doing it all through portals to the new ones, or at least they're, they're doing a significant number. How far that way? Oh, right, okay. Zoom, zoom. going to kill you before you start blasting. There you go. And the rest of you, you know, you can just kind of lump it. Only a few more levels and we can use Black Hole. And that'll make this a lot more efficient. the area, make sure we're prepped, and head on in. Okay, area clear, we've got this, let's kill this guy. Alright. Ooh. That's worth putting on. What do we have? Ooh, that's a pretty nice staff. It's two-handed though, which is a bit of a shame. Shield, this can go on you. Toughness, 110, 129, that's worth it. And that's better. And we're not going to put anything else on for the moment. Here we go. Inspect the cursed chest. This doesn't sound good. Kill six cursed burrowers. Oh, jeez. Are they just running? Well, at least my lightning blast from my armor is helping. Okay. Wait, did they just... They just borrowed! God damn it! Alright, that one that was running down this, this way. And his friend. Need more time. I need to be better. Did not do it in time. This is a hard one to get the bonus chest on. God damn it. Alright, I will get this last done. You, you, you. There we go. Wait, I've killed enough. Alright, I'll kill one more. It's only for good measure, though. Alright, oh, okay. One new one. Ooh, right, okay. Hello. Yeah, don't like frozen balls. That 
was sort of an interesting one. I do like the way that they're using the, uh, the portals to introduce new things without needing them to be connected up. That was quite quite nice. Yeah, let's head to uh, Rathma's Gift. Now, this might be the... Uh, yeah, Death Prisons that we need to destroy. I remember this one from before. Together in the bottleneck and blast them all. Like that. It's been a while since we've uh, seen a unique item. Thinking about it. Then again, we've only been really playing for a couple of hours, so I guess I can't complain. Let's do Death's Prison while he's distracted. Haha! <laughs> Killed you as well. To add insult to injury. Nice. Let's grab this and turn this off. I like the uh, dramatic slow motion running there. Very good, Corvic. Okay, three to go. Three to go. Are they going to be up this way? Not that bit. Let's head further around this way. through, leaving them all in the back. Oh, it's kind of a laser. Walking around with a portable military grade laser just blasting through all these things. Your defenses are nothing. Okay, 17, 18. I'm thinking we're gonna get up to massive numbers, but uh, Because everything's quite close to space together, we might be able to uh, do something. No, not quite. Not even enough barrels and stuff close enough together to get a speed bonus. Oh, well, I guess we are walking around the edge and looking for them the old fashioned way. Yeah, don't want to be in the middle of that. That stuff stinks. So that's a no round the edge. Let's just have a quick run through the middle once. Make sure there's nothing dotted up here, and then we'll move to the next section over on the right. Nope, I'm pretty convinced that it is not here. So one, two. Not ready yet. Nicely done. I am unstoppable. Okay. I really should take a look at some of the uh, other skills at some point. It's been a long time since I've uh, used Blizzard as well. It'd be worth, um, like, since before they started doing Seasons. It'd be worth taking a look and see if that's got anything interesting in it, or if you can make a viable build from it. Once I've uh, done the Firebird stuff, of course. Maybe I'll... Uh, Put myself a, a second mage together and try it on them just in case it ends up getting them killed or something silly. Yeah, doing all right holding up with the arcane power at the moment. Didn't see that coming, did you? Alright, where is the whale. Hello, Minra. Plague victim, eh? Oh, I guess it's a hard life. You stand there and I'll put you out of your misery. Or at least I'll put you out of my misery. 400, 300, 100. Unique wizard hat. Hello. Go away. Right. 
What is this? Let's just have a gander. Okay. It's the magistrate. Good if I was going for, you know, frost hydro, but for me, not so much. But at least I can hold on to it and uh, put it in an ice cube or something. Uh, right, looks like there may be a way down this way. Sorry, a way out. A way on. There we go. Finally. Extra dimensional speed's no use if you don't get immediately hit by cold blast. Okay, nearly got through. Fuck you, fuck you. And we can do this while that's all being distracted up there. Oh god damn it. Go away. Let's try that again. And then we'll immediately head to the other, and then we've only got one left to find. Nice, alright. A couple of things left to go. I don't know how many skeletal minions I'm up to now. There's a fair few, isn't there? There we go. Your grave awaits. So close. Kill it. Kill it. Kill this one as well. Right. Skeletons might hold everything up long enough. Yeah, good. A couple of the remaining things, and now we're back to hunting. So I guess as we go past, nothing really interesting there, but uh, let's kill the mobs anyway. Level 54 and a half and a bit. 54 and a half and a bit. Oop, big things. Let's uh, pull back this way just a little, and we will deal with them in a nice line. And we will deal with them in a nice line. We will hide around the corner and let them shoot the corner and take on the minions one at a time. Alright, one down. Two down. Yeah, you just stand in the middle of the skeletons and, and get yourself wrecked, mate. Big one down, good. All of the happy explosions. And yes, there is such a thing as happy explosions. But where, oh, where is this lost? Oh, hello. Prison. Oh. Shielding, mortar wall of shielding. Uh, at least they're dying quickly enough, but. Yeah, I've got a shield as well, mate. Lots of lightning everywhere. Oh. You and your little walls. Templar's getting a little confused by the skeletons in the way. Doesn't really know it's where to turn. To right, let's grab those. And let's just look for this last death prison. That way. Alright, hello guys. 
here to shut down your prison. You've not been uh, following regulations. Good. No one got any objections? Fine. We'll shut this down and we'll be out of your hair. Okay, right. Let's head on to the Burning Man. And skeleton minions have left my party. That's a shame. Alright, we are... Oh, the Wicker Man. Alright. Now, where was the way down? Was it this way? Yeah. Explore the sacrificial pit. Because that sounds like a good idea. Yeah. Pull you. And you're down. Right, let's grab that emerald. And in the pit we go. Once again, it seems like a brilliant idea. Oh, I'm dying pretty quickly. There we go. Now the witch might... Oh, right. Jeez. I get the feeling we do not want to be in the middle of all of that. That, that seems like horrible. I'm quite glad we got that little... Uh, thing. Oh, this is the, the wicker man that you get as a pet. Oh, well, that's that's so much better then. You know, I don't mind that he's a, a flaming doony thing. Nearly killed him. Okay. Right, let's head and kill Severig. And then I'll call this episode there because it's taken me a little bit longer to get through them at the moment. I noticed that because the last episode ended up about 1 hour 10 minutes, I think. 1 hour 10, 1 hour 20. Uh, we did have the crash as well. Um, but we went through two acts, and I don't want to uh, to overdo it. Right. Find the Realm Walker and enter the Realm of the Banished. Oh, it's this one. So the Realm Walker will be dotted around somewhere. He'll be looking like a portal on the ground. We'll find him. We'll kill him. And enter the Realm of the Banished. Then we start killing things. Alright. Da-da, da-da. Now. We should easily make it to uh, level 56 before this set is done. Let's kill that quickly. Alright, we're heading down this way. Is that the, uh, yeah, we're not going to help you, don't, don't even waste your breath. Need more time. Don't mind me, just, you know, coming through. Here he is. Hey, Realm Walker. Like there's a lot of things around here. Let's uh, pull back just a little bit. And we can uh, manage them a bit at a time. I didn't realise he shoots the little rock dudes down. Yeah. Your grave awaits. So he's not going to be alive for much longer. One whole electrified desecrator. Not a brilliant combination. Let's kill some of the uh, minion bits. God damn, these have got a lot of life. 
Not the little things, of course, but uh, all the way up to 63. That's the Realm Walker. It roams the outskirts of Pandemonium. Let's kill everything else. With a gaping hollow at its core. Somehow, it can hide its Yeah, it just blew it off by gaining a level. A Those who pass through it are trapped in a distant world. Can he successfully burrow under? One end. million? Yes, he is. Still, he is going down. Oh, god damn it. Thought we had that. There we go. Oh, that took a while. Alright. So, we've got road stick and into the realm. Oh, dying. Quickly enough. Let's uh, just get a couple more bits of our game power. And a fleeting shrine because increased movement is fun. It's a shame it doesn't uh, make the attack any faster, but. Uh, that's what frenzied shrines are for. That's arcane power back. On we go. I am unstoppable. Eleven mobs to go and the big dude. Well that's gonna be easy, let's find the big dude. Yeah, really easy. All all the mobs are dead. And he's uh about no, miles away. Okay. Oh, hello. I suppose we can fight on the way. I am so good. I astound myself. What are you? You are frozen, so we're backing up a little uh, teleport and night. Oh no, that's a different one. Oh, they're they're all different. Okay. Just die. Right. Okay, one down, two down, and the last one, illusionist orbit and nightmarish. Which is not a fun combination, but uh... could die easily enough. Dead. Grab that as well while we're passing. All right, on to Severag. Nearly there. Dodging falling rock bits left, right, and center, and here you are. Lost Demon Rider. Let's uh, clear the area. And frozen, that's not good. Better. You dare attack me! There you go. Now you've got no friends. Still pretty powerful, apparently, though. And still frozen. So these guys. So that gives us the option of running forwards or backwards. Let's uh, head over this way. Teleport failed that time. That was a bit weird. Nearly dead. Nearly dead. Got him. Okay, back to Tyrion we go. And uh, oh, just in time because I'm full of stuff. Uh, let's drop this. And we'll take Moon Vessel. I need to go back. Okay. Let's just clear a bit of space. Salvage all the blues. Covered all of them. And Tyrion. Your deeds, new we will take all of your bits. Let's uh, open these up. Frost and Star, Blood Magic Blade, Rune Stroke. That's alright. 
Okay, let's just uh, teach these to age up quickly. And um, let's drop this off in the to be converted box. Pretty awesome, pretty awesome. Okay, that goes down here. And are we going to use any of these? I don't think so. I think we're going to carry on with the extra experience. Because it's making such a massive difference to our leveling speed. It is tempting to uh, to re-gear, but uh, we can always wait to do that. Let's salvage all these bits. Alright, and we'll drop these off in the stash. <laughs> That's not good, I left that untidy. You go there, you go there. Right, let's move these down. Make space for the higher tier gems that we're going to need. Perfect. Okay, uh, I'm going to finish that episode there. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and uh, join me again soon for more Diablo 3. See you soon.